close your eyes and picture a quaint European city and Brooks just might be what comes to mind. One of the most famous and well-preserved cities on the continent, Brooks exudes charm from every cobblestone and canal. Brooks has most of its medieval architecture intact, making it one of the best preserved medieval towns in Europe. The historic center of Brooks has been a UNESCO World Heritage Site since 2000. Many of its medieval buildings are notable, including the Church of Our Lady, whose brick spire reaches 115.6 meters, making it the world's second highest brick tower. The sculpture Madonna and Child, which can be seen in the transept, is believed to be the only of Michelangelo's sculptures that have ever left Italy within his lifetime. Brooks' most famous landmark is the Belfry of Brooks, a 13th century belfry housing a municipal carillon comprising of 47 bells. The Belfry of Brooks, independent of the previously mentioned UNESCO World Heritage Site in Brooks, is included on the World Heritage Site of Belfries of Belgium and France. Brooks is also known for its less, a textile technique. Moreover, the city and the famous lakes would go to inspire the Thread Roots film series, the second episode of which, shot in 2011, was partly set in Brooks. Several beers are named after the city, such as Brook Blonde, Brook Triple, Brooks, Brooks Babylar, and so on. However, only the latter two, Brooks Zoth and Brooks Strafe Hendrik, are brewed in the city itself in the De Halde Mann Priori. For lunch, we tried the three most iconic food of Belgium and France, meatballs, frites, and hot chocolate. This year, the two Christmas markets in the city center were back, but this time in a completely new place. Brand new Christmas stalls finished in warm wood, which welcomed us in their atmospheric lighting in the typical winter glow style. These blissful winter hamlets with their cozy ambience and packed with gadgets helped us to get into Christmas spirit without any problems. But did you know that there are two markets and each of them have their own distinct character? On the market square, you'll find everything you would expect from a traditional Christmas market. And at Simon Steven Square, the emphasis is on short chains and craft products. So there is something Christmassy for everyone. Just beside the Belfry was the Brooks Town Hall, one of the oldest in Belgium, having constructed between 1376 and 1420. The facade of the delicate Gothic building displays the strong vertical emphasis characteristic of the style with soaring pilasters, three of which end in octagonal turrets, separated by tall gothic arched windows. The canals have for centuries been the veins of the city, winding through brooks and treating you to another magnificent view around every wind. Take a stroll or a boat trip and discover secret gardens, romantic bridges and medieval facades reflected in the water. Veiled in mist, a family of swans floating past, time stands still on the canals. The canal in Brooks is connected to three other canals. The Canal Kent Brooks, the Dame Canal and Bodewin Canal which leads to the port of Zeebrugge. Brugge Zeebrugge Canal, also known as Bodewin Canal, waterway built between 1896 and 1907 to connect Brooks in Belgium with the North Sea, thus restoring Brooks' ancient status as an ocean port. Brooks is one of the main locations in the much-awaited Bollywood film PK, which runs in Indian cinemas from 19 December. PK is the first Bollywood production that is shot in Belgium. The picture centers in Brooks, recognized by UNESCO as World Heritage, appear to be the ideal setting for the production team of the Indian director. Rajkumar Hirani. I'll conclude this video with the saying of the late Indian actor Sushant Singh Rajput. It's so easy to fall in love with a place like Brooks. Everywhere you look, you see such beauty. 
So that's it for today, our one day experience in Brooks. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like, share and subscribe if you have liked this video. And till then, stay healthy, stay safe and have a wonderful 2022. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.